Hi guys, it's my Rainbow Galaxy tutorial for nail art. What you're going to need is three different colors, a holographic top coat, and a clear top coat. Let's get started. I'm starting with a white base on my nails. I'm also taking a scrap piece of paper as shown here, and I'm just dabbing on the different colors that I'm using. I started with a pink fuchsia color, a bright yellow color, and a turquoise color, but you can use whatever color you choose. I also am using a beauty blender style sponge um, that I got from Walmart. I just take the little circles and I cut them into six, making a small wedge in the sponge like this, as you can see. It allows for a little bit cleaner of an application for the nail polish to the nail. When it hardens or dries out, it'll look like this. You're going to want to use a clean corner so you can make a more even application. You can layer up these different colors or keep it sheer. I'm using this color in the top third of my nail and blending it outward. You're then going to go and pick up your yellow color. You're going to put it on the bottom third of your nail blending it into the pink. We're gonna create that orange color of our rainbow fading into that yellow. Now the intensity of the color is up to you. You can create a little bit of a bolder color by adding more layers, or you can keep it really sheer and pastel-like uh, using lighter layers. I'm gonna go through now with my turquoise color. This one is a very sheer color, so I'm going to need to apply several layers of it over. But we're now creating that purpley color as well as that green color when it mixed with that yellow. Now what you're going to do, don't feel like you need to um, clean up just yet. We're just going to take a Q-tip and dip it in our non-acetone nail polish remover and we're going to clean up the outside part of the skin, not the nail. I think this step is crucial to making your nails look really nice. Now that we have cleaned up the nail, you're going to get your holographic top coat and place that. Uh, medium thickness is what I used over the top part of those nails to create that sparkly galaxy look. I also took a top coat and put it over the top of it as well once it was dried. Here's the look completed with the Rainbow Galaxy nail art. I took the hot fuchsia pink and put it on my thumb and my pinky as well. I have more tutorials and different nail art that I've done. I usually post every other day. You can follow me for more of these nail art ideas on my Instagram, Emma Flair. If you like this, give a thumbs up. Hope to see you guys back soon. Thanks.